Hi, everybody. This is the opening move for the Yang Cheng Fu 13 original postures. I'm going to break it down for you and pausing at each step of the way. So uh, it coincidentally, coincidentally, for those of you who do the William Chen form, it's the same opening as that one. But you might like a refresher on that as well. Here we go. So the uh, begin with your feet, uh, heels together, toes apart. And you want to establish your three pillars. Feel the balls of your feet. Reach with the knee wand. Tuck in the chin. Open up the jade pillow gate. Your knees are unlocked. You sum qua, so you spiral down and just really release that. Elbows out. Slightly reaching out. Reaching with the fingers. To establish your energetic coherence. So you establish your energetic coherence, your central equilibrium, and your Unkinking the hose by Sung Kwa, opening the jade pillow gate and opening the shoulders by reaching out with the elbows. So first you feel with the balls of both feet and allow your awareness to settle into that. So you're mentally and physically establishing a connection there. You're feeling, you're consciously getting this, the feeling of those of, of the balls of both feet. Now you feel the ball of the right foot. So you shift it from balls of both feet to the ball of the right foot and feel into that. Notice as you do that, you begin the process of establishing substantiality in the right leg by doing that, you've gone from weight 50-50 now, and the weight is still 50-50, but you're beginning the process of reaching through. Your mind is extending through your body, and you're establishing the neural connections to get that sensory input from your the ball of the right foot. You set the right knees. That means you want to feel your right knee over the ball of the foot. There's a sweet spot there where you're feeling really stable and supported of the, uh, the knee over the ball of the foot. Now spiral down to the left. And you do that by you're starting to load up the right leg. So when I say spiral down to the left, that means the your, your right claw is releasing as you're sitting down in the leg, there's a, a motion down. And notice that my posture, my uh, central equilibrium is still centered over the ball of my right foot. And now my right leg has about 70% of my weight. So the body's mass has shifted. I'm emptying out my left leg and I'm, I'm uh, establishing the, the uh, stability in the right leg. And then turn to the right. As you do that, you're still centering over the ball of the right foot. Notice you've got about 90% of your weight now in the right leg. You're getting a nice load there. The left leg is almost empty. We're going to empty it out now a little more by picking up the heel of the left foot. When we do that, we spiral down a little more to the right. We get feeling really sink into that right leg and then we're going to step out with the left foot. So as when we stepped out, there's a moment there where it's completely in the right foot, but we want to make this a nice even transition. So you're the more you can support your weight in the right leg, the easier that transition is as you step out. Boom, you place the foot down and you're just holding space with that right now. Feel the ball of the left foot now. So we're beginning that, the process of making the left leg substantial. It's gonna take the load now. Feel the ball of the left foot. Now set the left knee. So you're establishing the foundation. And 
and spiral down to the right. So now we're loading up the left leg. So we're emptying out the right leg. So the left qua is what is you're spiraling down to the right. You're sitting down more into that left leg as you do this, still keeping your center, still keeping your contact point with the left, the ball of the left foot and uh, with your left knee. And then turn pivoting on the right heel. So you use the left leg to make that turn. So now feet are both pointing ahead, feeling the balls of both feet, setting both knees, elbows out to the sides, reaching with the fingers. You're reaching with the knee one, sinking into the feet. So now we've established Zhang Ti Jin, which is a whole body energetic connection. And this is all the other jins, the expressions of chi in the body have that as their foundation, the Zhang Ti Jin. And we also have by reaching, pointing, reaching, we, we have established tensegrity throughout the whole structure and a whole body energetic connection. So there is a sense of, of fullness, wholeness. And we've also opened the energy gates. The open the gates to the big chi. So the chi is coming up through the bubbling wells in the, in the balls of your, uh, in, the, in the centers of your foot and coming down, the yang chi of the heavens is coming down to the, to the ni wan. So you are a conduit for the big chi and you're allowing that chi to circulate throughout the whole system. And then step in, deep breath, And as you push down, disappear the chi, throw it away. Okay, thank you.